The Memorial Cup is almost here and soon thousands of hockey fans will be watching their team fight for the Canadian Hockey League's biggest prize. But how will they get around town when they're not at the arena? TV 5's James Felton joins us in the studio to explain. James. When Saginaw and the Great Lakes Bay region learned they won the bid to host the 2024 Memorial Cup, one of the big things they had to address was transportation. And today, executives with the Saginaw Spirit say transportation will be a strength during the big event. Getting around what we thought initially would be a handicap, it's not anymore. It, I think it's going to be the strength of the Memorial Cup. Jimmy Green, Special Sales Director for the Saginaw Spirit, and Craig Goslin, President and Managing Partner of the Spirit, spoke with us about getting around during the Memorial Cup. Green tells us stars will play a vital role in getting residents and visitors alike where they need to be. Stars, oh my God, Stars has just been a dream. Wherever we needed to get people to, they stepped right up. They, they immediately have. We've got an incredible owner, Dick Garber, who's provided a fleet of cars for us. We don't have a vibrant Uber system here, but we will during the Memorial Cup. Green is advising people to utilize those Stars bus stops during the Memorial Cup. Stars has a route on where those closures are, and more importantly, it's free to ride Stars. Throughout the tournament, from any point in Saginaw County, you can hop on a Stars bus, come on down to the event park, leave your car where it is, and then you have that, that wonderful experience of getting back to your car without all the traffic congestion. So uh, we only have one street closure, and that's on Johnson Street, so it'll be easy for people to navigate with the exception of Johnson Street. Goslin tells us there will also be a street closure in Frankenmuth the place where the hockey teams will stay for the tournament. Yeah, and Frank, with uh, the second uh, part of the Memorial Cup, Curtis Road will be closed coming out. But the first part, thanks to uh, our Saginaw Township uh, and, and actually, actually Saginaw County, uh, they've been open, op opened up Curtis Road for us for that first weekend because we've got the balloons over Bavaria and we've got the Dog Bowl and the Memorial Cup all occurring in Franken. With that first weekend, it's going to be really busy, which is a wonderful thing for all the hoteliers and restaurants throughout the entire region. And uh, But yeah, Curtis Road is in the, in the second week will be closed. For his part, Green believes transportation in this area could see an impact that lasts far beyond the end of the Memorial Cup. I think what we're doing with transportation might be transformative. It'll make all of us in the region look at how we did what we did with the Memorial Cup and go, why can't we do that beyond the Memorial Cup? So transportation will not be a handicap or an issue for our fans getting around. The Memorial Cup kicks off this Thursday. Reporting in the studio, James Felton, WNEM TV5. Thank you, James. And if you plan on going, we want to remind you the Dow Event Center has a clear bag and cashless policy.